we had a great meet last week at Oregon State. There's no bigger motivation than winning. Okay, so I'm hoping and, and, and I believe that they're ready to go. I think Coach Marcus has done an outstanding job in preparing them. But like I tell my athletes, we can't run. Okay, so it'll be up to those athletes to get there and be competitive throughout the entire meet. And that actually starts when we board the plane. So if they're prepared when we board the plane and they keep themselves mentally in the game the whole time, make sure that they understand that this is a business trip, I think we'll do fine. Key's gonna be focusing on ourselves. If we can execute our race plan, strategy and our race plan, then the outcome's gonna be very favorable, I presume. But we're a very process-oriented team, especially championship time of year. It's all about execution, execution, execution. So we just need to focus on ourselves, execute our game plan, and let the chips fall where they may at the end of the race. I think on the men's side, we have definitely three front runners who can group up and play very well together. And now it's all about getting that last uh, two guys out of the back four to really step up. So the mission is it doesn't matter who does it as long as the front of the singles is Portland State. So we're looking out of four, have two guys really have big solid um, performances at the championships on Saturday. And then on the women's side, you know, there's a, a lot of excitement, a lot of confidence. Uh, people have seen their fitness get better and better. So I think if we can, again, focus on ourselves and execute our game plan, what we're going to see by the time all Portland State finishers cross that line is going to be something to be proud of. This part of the season is one of my favorite times of the year. Um, I'm a fifth year, so luckily I've had five years to practice championship racing, and I love this time of year because our team is really coming together, personalities, um, as well as just everyone's getting in shape and getting along. Having the three guys together to train is really the key to getting us uh, as fit as we are right now. Because last few weeks have been really, you know, tapered down to really get ready for this meet. It's going to be an extremely hard effort. We just try not to screw up. All the work's been done. So now we're what I call, we're in bubble wrap mode. So everyone's just bubble wrapped, safety helmets on, you know, going to bed early, staying in soft places, staying away from sharp objects. So, I mean, the fitness is there, the haze in the barn, all we can do now is screw it up. So that's, that's what we're trying to avoid is anything drastic, dramatic, or unplanned for.